Hello friends, welcome to another video. I Today I'm going to be showing you how to set up Evolution API. Quick and easy and simple, no errors, and uh, how to sort of integrate it into regular workflows, you know, in any turn automations. Um, <clears throat> it's really anything you'd like, even a uh, chat room. Well, I'll show, I'll show you how to set that up. So first thing we're going to do, is we're going to go to our Coolify instance. And this is sort of our deployment for Doc. It, it, it's sort of Dockerized uh, deployments of things. So go to your project, add new resource, simply type in Evolution API. It's native, so it's already in the list. Make sure you're on this version. So, you know, you have it. Uh, now, the first few things we need to do, we need to give it a domain. Manager. And then <clears throat> we will save, go back, edit compose file, delete this first part, and then have this equal uh, your uh, full domain where you are going to be hosting your uh, evolution API. And then in environment variables, we need to delete uh, one line and change one thing. So here, delete service FDQ and Evo, then have this, have the server URL equal your um, domain, the uh, full domain, so it's HTTPS. Click deploy. <laughs> so once that is done, you will then open it. Make sure it shows this page to show that the API is running. Go to manager. In your environment variables, you'll copy this API key. Never show this on stream. This is a this is for testing purposes. By the time this video is up uploaded, this will be gone. But never show anyone this because if they got this, they can just log in and uh, send messages from your phone. So you're going to be greeted with this. You simply copy your API key here. You log in. Make sure you click on English. So everything is in English, not uh, Portuguese. Press instance, testing underscore fun. This works for the Cloud API, as well as another instance of the Evolution API hosted. So Bailey's token, your phone number. So that's good, that's good. Save, click on it, get QR code, go to your WhatsApp. It, this works with personal WhatsApp as well as business. Scan the QR code under link devices. <clears throat> so that's linked now. That's fine. That's all set up. Now for the next part, you are probably interested in setting up chat root with this. Simply go to chat root. Go to your instance of chat boot. Let's uh, delete this. Well, while we're here, you know, when in Rome. Uh, Waha first. Uh, you don't need to create an inbox or anything. So profile settings, copy your access token here, put your access token in here, your account ID, whatever your ID is in profile. So mine is one. So just copy whatever this is here in account settings. Uh, this one. So account and then your URL for your instance of chatwoo. You simply put that here. Uh, name the inbox. So I'm say testing 
phone evil. Okay. You can name wherever you want. You can put underscores. It's all fine. Uh, tick this enable to say worst QS and auto create inbox. And let's just we don't see it in the list here, but it's gonna appear. Okay. Uh, save. Now, I've connected this before, so you're going to get a QR code here. All you do is you go on WhatsApp, and then you scan it here. So that's just to show that this is working. So so you'll see that this is all set up. This is working. Let's get a message. Um, WhatsApp to uh, check see how things are going. So you send it, and then you'll see. Oh, get get friend, a friend, a friend. So all of your WhatsApp messages will be received here. It's quick. It's easy to set up. You know. Uh, took. Less than five minutes. Uh, that's pretty much it. You know, the the guide is in English, which is just so nice, right? Um, you know, and you can have all of your responses here. You can uh, send, you know, files of. Uh, let's say you want, you know, a thumbnail of a, a very popular YouTuber. <laughs> Just sent, you know, you can, uh, you can have that. <laughs> um, now voice notes are a little bit buggy, uh, on this version of chat whoop. So yeah, you're gonna, you're gonna have to forego the, you're gonna have to forego those by sending those in, uh, in chat whoop. So. Apologies for that, as if I developed chat work, right? But yeah, if people send you messages as well, you or uh, pictures, you will you will you'll get them too. So let's say you have a picture of a very nice sunrise. What it look like, you know? So there you go. Hope you enjoyed the video, and hope it was helpful. Please leave a comment and subscribe.